identity that you all have to speak um, languages that you may have been able to be able to hear. <laughs> It would be interesting to know what inspired you to make such a dark drama in a times of recession when many of your colleagues would rather choose comedy. We were, uh, the, the writer and I were writing a, a, a family epic which was much, much more, uh, uh, much more bigger in, in size and, and, uh, and in terms of characters and storylines and it was a complex story. So we both uh, looked at each other and said, okay, let's put the script aside and let's just write the story about one man and, and one man's journey. And uh, we were quickly amazed by um, this, this idea of a man getting uh, hit by a snowplow in the middle of winter and, and having to, uh, to flee the scene of the crime. And then it's becoming the story about his guilt and the story about a man depending on, on this, the, this weapon of his crime to survive. So, and, and so this, this it, it, I think it all started off with, hey, that's cool, a guy getting hit by a snowplow, that's, uh, you know, and it could be funny. And then we start, okay, let's, but let's make something, you know, serious and, uh, and, and, and interesting about it. You have to understand something. I'm not a bad guy. It is a slow movie. Uh, having said that, uh, drama and characters are very intensive. How difficult was to make such an atmosphere? It it was and it wasn't in the sense that um, working. First of all, casting was was a very delicate um, thing because we we needed someone who could portray. Whom we would be interested in, in in watching his face for uh, 90 minutes and and it being compelling. So, uh, but at the same time, we needed an actor who could pull off the the the, the quirkier and, and and the funnier aspects. And uh, so, Thomas Hidden Church was a was a great choice. Um, he has that great comedic quality. He's a very funny man, but at the same time, he's got that um, that that cowboy-esque feeling that worked where we wanted to do a, 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 a Western with, with wool hats, you know, that's, that's what we wanted to, to, to pull off. What are you doing? Look at us. Look at us. Beginning of the end. I mean, are you happy the way that uh, audience in Canada and uh, in other countries receive the film? I'm very, very happy with how uh, here the reactions and uh, in in the U.S. up to now it hasn't come out in Canada yet, so I'm quite uh, anxious to see how uh, Canadians will receive it. Um, but Americans loved it when we were at Tribeca; they they were great, and they and and here as well uh, when at Carlo Vivari. Uh, the, the reactions were, were fantastic. People laughed when, 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 I, when we wanted them to laugh.